Hey everyone, there was a question on how to be able to get some incandescence on something in Sketchfab. So in Sketchfab, here is my model. Um, I'll be having a demo on how to be able to get these um, <clears throat> torch uh, items built in. This is using some very, very simple vertex bakes on here. And you can see there's some cleanup that needs to be done on it where it looks a little bit weird. <clears throat> but how can we get this thing to look like it is glowing? If I go to my 3D settings. So I have my little fire here. <clears throat> and if I go into my um, materials, it should be, now I named this wrong because that's how great I've been today. Um, but under this should be my fire material. Um, if I click on that, I can also locate the materials that are on certain objects. So it's pretty helpful to do that. So if I click on this one and now if I go into my first, I'm going to make it a little bit transparent because right now it's not, you don't even need to make a transparency map for something like this. Cause it's just going to drop it down the entire thing by being a little bit more transparent. So I'm going to go on my opacity, turn that on. And I'm going to bring that down. So if I go like maybe even like this, you can still see the actual torch in there and you see the fire on it. So that's pretty cool. Now, if I go into emission, turn it on. Well, let's change the color. And you can also go and actually just sample the texture. So we can just turn on that one and increase that. And that's going to kind of blow that out and actually make it. So even if I change my lighting in the scene where that's off, that thing will still glow. Now, glow in the sense it's not going to cast light on other things but that's okay here this would be the easiest way to be able to get something to be glowing like a little sphere like a magical sphere and all that stuff so this is the easiest way to be able to get the emission working in sketchfab hopefully that was helpful